you know, the first thing you do when you walk up to these, you make the decision whether you can get it out of there because you can actually make a bad situation worse. Yeah. If you make the wrong call on these and say you can get it out and then find out once you start cutting, you can't, you make it so right now this is somewhat secure in that tree and you can make it so it isn't secure and now you can't get it out either. Yeah. All right. So in this case, what do you think? Can that come out of there? I think it can. I think it can. I agree. What you kind can. of bind is this under right here? Kind of a bind, top bind. There you go, it's a top bind, okay? So before we go any further with any of that, <coughs> what's, what's one of the first things that should be done before you even start on this tree? Before we start on this tree? Before you start on getting rid of this hang up, what else, what needs to be done? Clear out your clear, clear, out, clear out your area so you, you have an escape route. route. Okay, you need to have good escape route safety zones. We talked yesterday that in the timber industry, the number one thing out there that injures or kills fallers is this yep. right here, these hangups. Yes. Yeah. That dead aspen right there needs to go away. Okay, if you haven't worked a lot in aspen stands, there was a fatality in Colorado. <laughs> branch to hold it up? I don't, do I? That upright enough? Push it yeah. up. Now we'll move the saw, try to pull it out of the way. 
or push it out of the way, whichever works. I said pushing it out of the way if I work, drag the back end out this way and try to push it over. Sometimes just rolling it will work. That one's still caught pretty good, so we don't want to snap any of those out of there, right? Right. Okay. How was it? Good. Good. <laughs>